Well, as I suspected, we have the BMS alarm going. Can't hear it for sure. Well, as I suspected, we have the BMS alarm going. Can't hear it for sure. Well, that blessed silence, well, from the alarm anyway, so the supply bus will kick back in soon. Well, might as well have breakfast, because fortunately we have a manual uh, pump for the sink as well. One problem is the LPG solenoid is active. No, I could easily bypass that, but I think I'll just wait for power to come. Oh, we've got another bar on the display, so it only got down to 20%. I like to run the bank well within its mid range for longevity. Uh, what I can do is re-spool uh, this uh, old rod. The uh, line I'm sure is suffering from the UV it's been subjected to. Well, we have supply bus on and we're currently charging at just under 100 amps. Obviously the battery is not 99% full. Oh, well, while we're 
using for the uh, battery to charge up a fair bit, let's uh, do a tour. And as you can see I've had my spring shear. Okay, we'll head down into the starboard hull. And this is the untidy captain's cabin. And we have wardrobe, drawers, bed, and storage. Uh, the bed's on top of the uh, tunnel and I've got lights and fan uh, more storage and the hatch which is up beside the helm position right, working our way forward and here is the shower room we actually use it particularly much because in summer you just stand on the back of the boat after you've been for a swim and use the handheld shower. Uh, heading forward, we have the toilet. pieces, a few batteries for the Roby gear, and up in here is the bosun's locker, storage, for overflow tools etc, and there's far too much stuff in here but it might, might become useful one day. Alright, back up on the bridge deck. Toolbox doubles as a seat. And try and keep it tidy, but things do move on a boat. Most of the stuff I need for general maintenance is here. And heading down to the port side. We have the galley, double sinks. And this one here is from the manual fresh water pump. Two burner stove, oven, grill, fridge, and plenty of storage. That's a nice big galley. Uh, stern, we have another double cabin up the other side, apart from the intrusion from the cockpit above. Right, here's the Ford cabin, it's a large single or a intimate double uh, storage. And the canned goods basically are all here.
Chelmsdown. Just like that, Chelmsdown too. That's an hour and a half, and we're still running about 100 amps. And He's come to see me. But Matthew's come to visit too. Up from Auckland. 